so it took me forever before I was able to post this sorry for the delay all right if you saw the thumbnail picture of this video it is originally women and spending and not women investing why because some other people think that women is such as spenders and not investors women can pretend not to be smart silly and confused when it comes to finance but the truth is we women can be smart when it comes to money we know more than we ever let on we have uncanny common sense and priceless intuition but today on this video we're gonna change that mindset the fact that money investing and finance have not been the role of women in the past we're gonna change that because time have changed and everything's changed. It's no longer a valid excuse to say, I'm not good with money, I'm not good investing, I don't know how to do that and do this, blah, blah, blah. That mindset is already in the past. What does matter is the choice you make today. So today, we have two choices. Number one, Accept that you have no place in the world of money and investing. And that is to be content in balancing a checkbook and paying the family bills. Number two, or choose to take control of your financial life. Know that your financial future is up to you and no one else. Get smart with your money, get prepared, take action and go make things happen. Okay, so that that will be your two choices for today while you are listening on this video. It is a decision time. Am I going to commit to do what it takes for my financial success or not? If not, then I understand that I am agreeing to allow someone else to be responsible for my financial well-being and accept the consequences that go along with that. If on the other hand, I am willing to commit, then it's time to put aside all the excuses and get to work. The choice is yours, okay? Women make great investors. The, st the statistics prove it. The statistics shows that time and time again that women are natural investors. Do you know that? Here are a few facts. Let me just let me just show you that on the screen. It says here a 2000 National Association of Investors Corporation study found that women only clubs achieve average annual returns of 32% since 1951 versus 23% percent for men only investment clubs and another a study of investment behavior by terence odian professor at the university of california um, found that women actually get better returns than men okay 1.4 percentage points better and another a 1995 NAIC study revealed that women only investment clubs outperform men only investment clubs in nine of the past 15 years. And the last, a study done by Merrill Lynch investment managers found the following investment behaviors among men and women. Here is another statistics as you can see. Um, women has more percentage than men. The verdict is in. Women do know how to handle money. There are countless articles about who is better at investing, men or women. But I don't agree to the idea that as a whole, one gender is better than at investing than the other. It's not about who is better than who, but about her or his skills, her or his knowledge, her or his experience that makes the difference between profits and losses in the world 
of investing. I have a little secret. Once you get into the investing game, it's fun. You love it. You can't wait until your next deal. You see, it's fun making money. It's fun to learn and grow. It's fun investing and earning. Women make fabulous investors. Maybe some of the viewers here are thinking about what business to do, where to invest in, how I'll make my money grow, what to do about my finance. Especially during this pandemic, it's kind of hard where to get money right now. But it's about to learn, to read, to search, and to ask. It's time to make action to what you're thinking and desiring right now. Let us not be a woman that is a lot of talk but zero action. Like you wanted to change your life but wasn't to do anything different. Don't be afraid making a difference or changing your mindset. God's got you. Many people say, I'll avoid eating rice to lose weight. But really, you'll avoid rice for just 7 days. How can you lose weight on that? Many people want to be fit, but who actually shows up to the gym? Yeah? Don't be a scared stiff when it comes to investing. You can do all things through Christ who strengthens you. Okay, let's talk about fear. If you are afraid investing your hard-earned money to, in to any investment, please know that you're not alone. It's not, it's, it's normal to have fear. To think thousands of times if you're gonna invest or not. Investing is risky. I'm going to lose money. What if I can't pay my bills? What if my husband kills me? I'll be homeless. I'll be out on the streets. I'll never forgive myself for doing this. No. Seriously? Are you really gonna die if you'll make one investment? Of course not. Like, hello? But this is what we feel sometimes, right? Don't let fear take control like the one you did. You let your heart love that person. That's why you're hurt. You're, that's why you're hurting now. So sad. Just kidding. Let me share to you how many times I invested in. I started investing um I started investing when I was at my teenage years. I have a couple of friends who loves photography and we started venturing out in photo and video services. I have my DSLR, we bought printer, accessories for photo booth, studio lights and etc. And the exciting part about it, you wanna hear it? We failed! Congratulations! <laughs> but I didn't stop there because guess what? I didn't fail, I learned. On that point, my mindset changed. Because of that, I want to pursue more in doing business. I learned how to handle money well and what to invest next. I didn't stop from there. I invested in multi-level marketing or networking. You know, selling beauty products, soaps, vitamins, etc. I invested in stock market. And right now, because of the pandemic, the Philippine stock market is really down. And I invested in gold coins. If I don't have anything to invest in, I will buy gold coins in Saudi. And I started baking cheesecake and selling them. I sell online. Everything that I can sell, I sell it. I enjoy selling online. And the latest, I did beauty, cos beauty and cosmetics in Saudi Arabia. I learned doing facial, Korean BB glow, laser hair removal, whitening, etc. This is the expensive investment I did, but it went well. Take note, the money I invested on, um, on that is from my own, it's from my own pocket except the photo and video, the investments is from my parents. I learned a lot. I enjoy being self-employed. I love being my own boss. That's why I don't want to be unemployed because 
I want to be my own boss like I want to work with my own time frame and there are more things to invest in you can search in the internet but I want to encourage you that you can do it you can step forward and create your future don't be afraid because God's got you and um, just just know what your passion is if you want financial freedom or if you want to retire rich financial IQ is more important than your academic many can't live without paychecks now it's time to change that don't spend your whole life studying and working hard for ordinary income don't aim for ordinary income but aim for passive income okay know about um know about ordinary income what's ordinary income what's portfolio income what's passive income these are the three main categories yet there are many other types of income if you are serious about having financial freedom begin studying the different types of income which will allow you to become rich without working forever don't wait until 65 before you start a business you can search and start now don't let your fear steal your dreams set a retirement date write down a plan on a piece of paper once you have set the date for your early retirement put that plan on your refrigerator so you have to look at it every day update the plan as you progress and learn more and more you should have a mindset that if you retire you will making more money and not less you can i know you can achieve your dreams and you can achieve your goals okay someday hard works will pay off so just continue searching on what you want to invest in you can sell online food um beauty products something like that start start from somewhere because you'll you'll learn more about things so i hope this this video encourage you to step forward and start the business you want or start the investment you want because i know you can do it you are a strong person i know so if you think this could help other people who wants to invest please share it to them and don't forget to subscribe thank you for listening thank you for stopping by god loves you